Hello, everyone. Thanks so much for logging on to CBSDenver.com. Time for a few more minutes with our Xfinity Monday Live guest, Nugget Center, Mason Plumley. Uh, so we ended the show talking about autographs and how you went out and uh, were asking casual fans for their autographs. What is the weirdest article that you have ever been asked to autograph? Article? Yeah. Um, or, or whatever, oh, say, you yeah, know, yeah, like. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one. Um, I don't to me it's always weird like when people don't have anything so they just like I don't, some kid had a polo shirt on that his mom had clearly just bought him and he's like will you will you autograph my shirt I'm like your mom's not going to be happy if you come <laughs> home and you have my my scribble on your new it looked like a school uniform um that's always weird iPhones um people always Wait, you autograph the iPhone? Yeah, autograph iPhones. Like but, on the back or on the screen or what? No, on the back. But people love to hand you like laminated stuff where it just wipes right off. Yeah. And so you get some random things, but you always get like arms or like, I don't know. Where's the weirdest place that you've ever been where someone has said, hey, can I get your autograph? The bathroom. Yeah. That's that's, that's, always, that's yeah. super. Don't do that. Yeah, that's like. Hey, can you sign this piece of toilet paper for me real yeah. quick? No. There's public restroom etiquette. You know, <laughs> just wait till I get out, out the door. Hey, let's talk about this team. And you guys are sitting there at seven and two. I don't think it's a surprise to anybody that inside that locker room, there are really high expectations. Yeah. And outside that locker room, there are really high expectations. What is that like? Because that is different for this franchise. Yeah, I just think it's embraced. Um, it's invited. Um, I could just tell you, like, what we talked about at training camp is is above and beyond any external expectations. And, um, you know, you asked about the media earlier. I think some cities, they put they put it on teams when they're not ready. But this team, um, the leadership of this team, uh, the core, they have aspirations, and, and we want to do big things. So um, we're not afraid of any, you know, talking about championships or, or going for it this year. So um, we're, we're more so embracing it. Is that different? Because I think there are some teams that would shy away from that type of expectation and that type of talk. Yeah, I think um, there are teams, whether, you know, they're they're young or, or they haven't even been to the playoffs. There are certain things that, that they haven't accomplished yet to feel like they can they can say those things. But, you know, we, we're happy with how we um, played the playoffs last year and then uh, our front office made some really good moves um, with the roster. So we, we just feel like we can compete with anybody. And, and in a seven-game series, we like us against anybody. You guys are at home tomorrow night. What's the scouting report going into that one? Atlanta's playing well, man. They, they're uh, really young. They get up and down. They spread the floor. They can all shoot the ball. So uh, it'll be a different style of play um, than we saw last night. But we'll, um, we'll adjust and we'll be ready. Did you see what Trey Young did to LaMarcus Aldridge the other night? I did. And I, I tend to switch on guard, so I'm going to have to be ready. <laughs> yeah. Please don't let that happen to you. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man, really enjoyed the visit tonight. Yeah. Thank you so much for stopping by. And thank you for logging on to CBSDenver.com.